What's going on YouTube? This is your boy like one half of, um one half of in duo. I want to do a quick video. A quick annoying video. Now the reason I'm doing this video is because after the direct, basically with the direct I should say. With the direct. With the direct, we had um, what were we gonna say? We had um, to talk about the Mario movie that's coming out next year. Now, I've saw a lot of people with this. This is one of the reasons I do not be on Twitter. I, and Twitter's a cesspool. Y'all could be on it. I don't want to be on that. It's a cesspool of nonsense. But people, of course, making an uproar as the usual BS that kills me. Oh. Is it, it's not an Italian, it's not an Italian, I'm like, oh, this crap. It's not an Italian per character play Mario. What? Who? No, and, it was, and of course, the way that they um, showed the, this, one of the stories, they're looking at like, oh, it's uh, Nintendo fans or this, it's not. Now, I'll give, I'll say this before I move on. It's Twitter, so I know, like I said, it's a cesspool. But... Really, let's look at the logical. Most of the people who are, most of the people who are angry, they're not um, they're not um, not that. Sorry. They're not um, Nintendo fans. Most of these are just basically woke people again, the social justice word, making not making noise for no daggone reason. Saying, okay, it's not an Italian person playing Mario. If it was made by a Japanese person who got an Italian name, voiced by a guy who was not Italian either. Why, why don't you make your arguments then? Oh, wait a minute, you can't because you just you guys just love to make arguments about race and all kind of nonsense, which is stupid. Charles Charles Lane is not a, is not Italian, so it's kind of weird that you brought it, you guys bring that crap up now. It's so stupid. Now I'll say this: it is a little bit messed up, and I know what it is. It's business. I'm a business person. I get it. I wish that they give Charles Matinee, the, um, you know, they give Charles the, the role. He is in there, and I think he should have been in, in voice Mario still. I think he should, but. Remember, uh, businesses, you want to get more people in the seats other than the fans. And I think, I think Nintendo, you, you, you shot yourself in your foot a little bit. I think you have enough fans to carry the movie if you had kept Charles Manor. Because, again, he's the voice of Mario, Luigi, Waluigi, um, you know, stuff like that. So, I think you should immortalize him in the movie, in, in that since he gave you years, what, Almost 20 years of voice for Mario. I think you should have. You should have let him do it. Now that I understand. But. They want to get. Of course. They want to get more people in there. So the names will draw. The, the normies. The people who are not Mar Who don't know Mario games as much as us gamers. Now I have no problem with Chris Pratt playing Mario. I don't know. I'll see the trailer. That's what it is. If I don't see something to go into the theaters, I'll wait until they come DVD or whatever. Like I did with Sonic. I didn't went to Sonic to, to see, but I did. Sonic was pretty good, and I'm happy to see what we'll do. But I'm just surprised. Like I said, for for the for the J the um, SDWs, like Mario was that. Why did you did not say nothing back then? It's kind of like when um. I remember this meme, not a meme, this Twitter that happened when this woman when um in a costume in Mario Odyssey and people was like, oh, it's not a costume and it's kind of racist and blah, blah, blah. And I remember a Hispanic person from Mexico say, hey, um, hey basically, hey, 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 punta, seriously, shut the hell up. I forgot what it was, but I, I did show it in one of my videos a long time ago. It was like, no, it's a representation of cool. So you don't talk for a shut up. And I like that. 
they're like, oh, it's, it's kind of racist because in cultural appropriation, Kamara is wearing a sombrero. Uh, have you seen? Have you seen the rest of the stuff Mario is wearing in a game? I swear, some of you people killed me with that stuff. Not that. I want to see because they said it added they added music. But it is just weird for me in that regard. French the rest of this game but just want to point that out which is annoying I just I, I, don't, I don't I don't get it in that regard and last but not least like um, it looks like once again I might not be super the connections but I might be I'm hoping to um, the week before Metroid um, comes out like I said I want to do a Metroid podcast and before that, I might, I, uh, my friend might hook me up with a digital copy of, um, of Metroid Dread. I was going to buy one anyway, but she, like I said, he was going to give it to me. So I'll get it like, I should be getting it around my birthday, which is this week, Wednesday. So I'll be starting Metroid Dread before people, but I'm not, I'm, if you've been to my channel before, I'm not a spoiler person. I don't do crazy stuff. I could give you a quick preview. If you guys want me to do a little video about the preview, let me know in the, in the comment section if you want me to do that. But other than that, yeah, I just wanted to put my two cents out and you're going to be some, you're going to see some videos coming up. I've done some, this game itself right here. I've done a discussion review on this game. And also more of stories, and there are gonna be some more games, of course, that I'm gonna, um, you're gonna see me do discussion review on, okay? Or maybe Katie, because I forgot we got um, Sonic Colors and um, Wally, which I asked her to, I want her to do that for me as well. With that, hope you guys have a good night. I'll catch you all later. Peace out. Remember, there's no perfect games out there. What's perfect to you is not perfect to me. What's perfect to me is not perfect to you. Simply enjoy games on all consoles, including PC. Peace.